Hey there! Welcome back to another exciting adventure on our channel. Whether you're a long-time subscriber or just stumbled upon us, we're thrilled to have you here. Get ready to dive in, learn something new, and most importantly, have some fun. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on the latest content. Now, let's jump right in. I, Genghis Khan, was born in the rugged lands near the border of modern-day Mongolia and Siberia around the year 1162. From humble beginnings, I rose to become the founder and first great Khan of the mighty Mongol Empire, forging a legacy that would echo through the annals of history. My early years were marked by hardship and adversity. My father, Yesuge, was the chieftain of the Borjigin tribe, but his untimely death when I was just nine years old left my family vulnerable and cast adrift. We faced betrayal and abandonment by our own kin, struggling to survive amidst the harsh realities of the Mongolian steppes. But adversity only strengthened my resolve. I learned the ways of the land, honed my skills as a hunter and a warrior, and instilled within myself the values of loyalty and resourcefulness. I was determined to reunite my family and restore honor to my father's name. Through strategic alliances, cunning diplomacy, and the strength of my arm, I began to assert my authority over the scattered Mongol tribes. I earned the trust and respect of my fellow warriors, and one by one, I united the disparate tribes under my banner. In the year 1206, I was proclaimed Genghis Khan, the universal ruler of the Mongolian people. With the establishment of my rule came the birth of the Mongol Empire, a vast dominion stretching from the steppes of Central Asia to the shores of China. Under my leadership, the Mongol Empire expanded with unmatched speed and ferocity. My armies swept across the land like a tempest, conquering kingdoms and empires alike. Through innovative tactics and unwavering determination, we brought entire nations to their knees. But my legacy is not merely one of conquest and bloodshed. The Mongol Empire became a beacon of trade and cultural exchange, fostering communication and commerce across the vast expanse of Eurasia. The Silk Road flourished under our rule, connecting East and West in a web of prosperity and exchange. In the year 1227, I departed this world leaving behind a legacy that would endure for centuries to come. My descendants, the great Khans, would carry on my legacy, further expanding the boundaries of the Mongol Empire and leaving an indelible mark on the course of history. Today, I am remembered not only as a conqueror, but as a visionary leader and a symbol of Mongolian strength and resilience. My name echoes through the ages, a testament to the power of determination, leadership, and the indomitable spirit of the Mongolian people. And that's a wrap for today's journey. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Your support means the world to us. If you have any questions, suggestions, or just want to say hi, drop a comment down below. We love hearing from you. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and turn on those notifications to stay updated on all our future adventures. Until next time, take good care of yourself. Bye for now.